Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Okay, uh, this video is a little bit different. I'm going to uh, react to all of the trailers of like the animals that are coming out in 2021. And the trailers I'm going to react to are like the popular animes. And I'm going after reacting to the trailers, I'm going to talk about uh, a few of the other animes which are being <clears throat> going to air in uh, January 2021. And so please, please be sure to like uh, keep like uh, stay tuned till the last of the video because I have a uh, quite a few things to talk about uh, because uh, January 2021 has a huge a lot amount like uh, like a huge amount of animes that are coming out which are probably going to be good and if each and every one of them becomes like is really good then January 2021 be will be like having the vast amount of like best animes that is out there so yeah okay uh, okay uh, one thing I'm going to mention before starting is that uh, obviously these trailers have a lot of like uh, songs and everything so it might like uh, if I like uh, play the sound I might my uh, video might get copyright claimed so and blocked so I don't want that obviously so I'll be only like providing the um, video without any sound and I'll be linking down the uh, links from where I've seen the videos uh, in the comment section uh, one by one so that if you want, guys want the sound you can like go there and play it in the background so only the, only the video will be there and also the video will be kind of edited so because so that copyright bots don't like get my neck like uh, uh, this thing is ridiculous in, in the YouTube is becoming more and more like I don't know what to say so anyways please uh, like bear with me because uh, I if I could have I would have like showed the video the uh, sound everything but unfortunately I cannot uh, so yeah anyways uh, so uh, the first anime of uh, like uh, 2021 January uh, trailer that I'm going to react to is promise Neverland season 2 all right so here we go okay I'll be linking down everything in the comment section Okay, let's see. All right, this is from the season one. Oh. Oh. Wow, there are. Oh, demon helping humans. Oh, okay. Yeah, so season two will be more like with demons. Wow. Wow, we'll see more demons. We barely saw them in season one. Okay. <laughs> well, I've seen Attack on Titan, so I know that pretty well. <laughs> Damn, okay. All right, that was um, Promise Neverland season two trailer. All right, uh, I'll talk about everything at the end. So first, let me like uh, finish uh, reacting to it. All right, so the next one is Dr. Stone season two. All right, let's start. <clears throat> All right. Damn, the three of them. And Sukasa Stone Wars. Whoa. Bloodless Siege. Wow. <laughs> Damn. Okay, Taiju and 
Usually I'm also doing that part. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh, the songs. Oh, a rugged judo practitioner. Okay, these are new characters. Archer. Wow. Glum Nitric. He still has. Okay. Okay. Ho ho ho. Alright, so. Aha, this was. Um, Dr. Stone. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Okay, the next one. Uh, the time I got reincarnated is a slime season 2 trailer. Let's see. I have almost forgotten almost everything about slime. It was quite a long back. I'll have to like check season out one out again. This anime is more of a like like a fantastical okay I'll talk later let's see what's happening Okay Oh yeah it's jogging in my memories like I remember a bit now Oh my god you're jinxing it Jinxing it. Oh, what the hell was that? Damn. Lightning Tigers. Wow. Wow. Beast. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, as always. <laughs> Please run. Oh, a new summoning or something? Something happening? Someone? Oh, this, this is a girl, isn't it? We saw her in this first season. Barely. Okay. Muran. Okay. Monsters versus humans. Okay. This is more going towards kingdom building, kind of. Okay, um, I think this is going more towards um, kingdom building or something like that, like as I said, monsters versus humans or something like that. And more political kind of issues are going to come up, I think. Anyways, let's get to the next one. Okay, the next one is ReZero Season 2 Part 2. Obviously, I'm going to react to this because I've reacted to the other part. And I'm too excited for it to start. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> oh boy. Yeah, it kind of ended abruptly in Season uh, 2. Wow, the song is quite good. I can hear like as always. This is re zero. The song will obviously be good. What the hell am I saying? Okay, it's like showing the previous parts. <coughs> Thinking about it, there are a lot of things Subaru has to like. Uh, solve.
perfected <laughs> okay this song is really amazing it's showing the same thing okay am, am i reacting to the wrong trailer Oh, we can see Park. We barely saw Park in season two. Oh, these are new things. <laughs> oh, that smirk at the end. <laughs> okay. All right. Damn, that was. Ah, the last smirk. <laughs> okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, the next one. This is Beastars Season 2 trailer. Now, I have plans to react to this and because this is quite a unique show and I obviously I've seen Season 1 so I can't react to that. So Season 2 is where we start. So anyways, let's start the trailer. Last Ultra? What? Oh boy, what the hell. Okay. This is one unique show, I have to say. I held off my I held myself off reading the manga because I wanted the anime. Oh. What the hell? Oh, this will be more like finding the criminal or something this season. Oh, we've seen lions. Oh, damn, Legoshi is looking. This is Orochimaru's voice. Oh my god, the song! <laughs> Oh, wow, this one is amazing. I can feel it. Damn, 2021 starts off pretty damn strong. Oh my god. Oh, I cannot contain the excitement. The song, the visuals, each and everything. What the hell is this? Oh my god. <sighs> I think this is the best trailer out of all the trailers I've seen. My god, this was something else. Like, this trailer was something else. Uh, like, each and everything was like top notch. <sighs> okay, the next one. Okay, this is. Mushoku Tensei. Now, this one is a new anime, and I know that this is probably like I think this is the like uh, one of the first kind of not first, but uh, the anime that kind of introduced this whole isekai trope. Uh, I'm not sure. I've heard a lot of people saying that. Uh, people saying that this is like the uh, original one, uh, but people are probably going to ignore it. And I know this is pretty damn good because. I have I I feel like I've read the manga few chapters the pre, uh, first few chapters and I was pretty damn entertained uh, at that time it was like barely starting and I kind of discontinued it and forget forgot about it but now like seeing the anime I kind of remembered that this is a like a isekai and this is probably going to be good so let's see the trailer I will probably react to this as well uh, so all right let's start <coughs> Oh, Dracoon doing his job again. What the hell, Dracoon? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, this is Gintoki's voice. My god, this is Gintoki's voice. Okay. Alright. 
I can kind of remember a few things, but still it's hazy. This guy is pretty OP as far as I remember. Oh. <laughs> Okay, his younger voice is obviously younger, but his adult voice is Gintoki's voice. Okay, I feel this is going to be good. Like, I was a little bit concerned about the adaptation, if it will live up to the manga, but I think it will be good. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow, Gintoki's voice is really like amazing to hear. All right. I feel this is probably going to do justice to the manga as well. Not that I remember how the manga was, but still, like, as far as I've heard from other people, uh, the manga is pretty damn good. So, I think this will probably do justice to the manga. And the one thing I always have, uh, like, fear is, like, adaptation. Like, if an adaptation is good or not. Like, a lot of, uh, like, mangas kind of get butchered by the anime adaptation. And I really want, don't want popular series to, like, face that problem. Okay, uh, that was that. On to the next one. All right, uh, this is Horimiya. Now, uh, you guys must be, uh, like a lot of people might not have known this, but Horimiya is kind of, I think a shoujo ma uh, manga. And I have read it, and quite a long time ago, and I forgot each and everything. But as far as I can remember, I re usually do not like, uh, like shoujo manga or anime, with a few exceptions. There are two exceptions I have of shoujo uh, anime. Number one is Kaicho wa Metsama, and number two is Ore Monogatari. Those two were like amazing and I really loved those two. Uh, other than that, I usually do not like shoujo, uh, like the whole shoujo thing. But I was really surprised, Horimiya, uh, after reading the manga, I can kind of like remember uh, faintly. I do not remember the each and everything, but I can remember that the story I was pleasant, like not pleasant, I was really surprised. Like usually in uh, what like in shoujo manga that I really do, what the thing that I do not like is the excessive drama like the overplayed cliches each and every, like drama huge dramas and like I really don't like that part uh, like Kaichoba Metsama also had that a few uh, but a, in a lot less amount and I really like Misaki and uh, Usui like those two were like my favorite couples to exist in anime. So I like I really liked it uh, it was kind of an exception and Ore Monogatari I as far as I can remember it had a little less drama but uh, and Horimiya like Horimiya feels at the, at the beginning it kind of feels as if it is full of drama but as it progresses I was extremely surprised that it was such a good manga like it was uh, such an amazing I, 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 I can't remember the things uh, each and everything but I can remember the feeling that I was really amazed by this manga and I really enjoyed it. So obviously I've forgotten each and everything and I have discontinued the manga after that uh, because of lack of time. But the anime is here and because I'm an avid anime watcher, I think like I'll definitely watch this obviously. Probably won't react to this but uh, this is like if you guys are like want like in search of a new shoujo manga uh, anime, this is the one like Horimiya. Uh, I, I know there are like uh, two or three trailers of this anime, but I'll probably do the first one that is Hori and Miyamura version, I can see. Uh, because obviously the lack of time and uh, that video will be lengthened a lot because I have a lot to talk about later on as well. So, alright, uh, without uh, like any more uh, talking, let's start. Start! <clears throat> oh boy, this doesn't have... Oh yeah, I can remember. Like this girl is kind of like like kind of really like okay, I'll say this later. Kind of like a, a slob in the ho in home, the girl. 
not a slob but uh, she like uh, as far as i can remember she was more like in a school she was like a perfect girl but at home she was uh, like i i th- as far as i can remember she had a few brothers i think or uh, yeah brother or sisters and because of like taking care of them she was really uh, like had unkept hair uh, wore only kind of like a sh- t-shirt or something did not dress up properly no makeups nothing and just went uh, like did her thing went out shopping and all and she really did not want that uh, image to leak out to uh, in the uh, in school and in school she was like a prim proper perfect girl and uh, like this the guy that is the main protagonist he kind of like found that out and i think the guy was uh, kind of opposite i can't remember i really cannot remember what was with the guy did he also had a persona uh, i really can't remember that but the girl i can remember she kind of like wore a persona not a persona but <clears throat> a different image in school and yeah that is the story basically so yeah um if you guys are really like um <coughs> looking for a shoujo <coughs> anime new shoujo anime this is the one um like the manga was amazing as far as i can remember so yeah if you like this might fly under the ra- radar for a lot of you guys but uh, i'm telling you that the manga was great if the adaptation is like does justice it will be good all right i think that was it for the trailers Oh, there's another one. Okay, uh, just a sec. Now, this is Kumo Deska Nanika. Now, I'm not sure about this particular manga, uh, like manga, I think this is, or light novel, I'm not sure. But I've been seeing this uh, in like uh, development, I think, for quite a long time, like I think two or three years, uh, not two or three years, but I think two or one year. Like it was all always at the back of the list, like in MAL, like my anime list. It was always in the back of the list. So I was really curious about this. Like, what was this? So I think this is probably quite a popular uh, manga. I think I'm not sure about the whole thing, but uh, let's check this out. Like uh, this will probably be an, another one of those good animes. Let's see. Okay. I think this person turns into a spider. Excuse me. <clears throat> yep, it's an isekai spider thing. <laughs> yep, that's a spider. Well, wow, it's a cute, cute spider. <clears throat> oh. Oh, there are other reincarnate. Oh no. <laughs> okay, this is pretty fun. I can, as I can see, like spraying web here and there. Okay. <laughs> what is that? Oh my god. <laughs> okay. The trailer barely showed us anything. Anyways, um I I had no idea about what this is, but obviously this is an isekai uh anime and it's a person turning into a spider. Okay, that's something new. <laughs> All right. Okay, I think that is it for the trailers. All right. Now I'll have to talk about a few things. Um so what I wanted to talk about is obviously like I'm uh, like my plans I'm going to do um, I'm already doing my uh, attack on Titan like that is there and the other uh, animals that I'll replace that are like uh, I'm going to do Promise Neverland number one uh, Stone uh, Doctor Stone number two and um, ReZero obviously that is number three and Beastars number four. Now I'll be doing Beastars this uh, January 2021, and the another one I will do is Mushoku Tensei. Like these five. Unfortunately, I won't be able to do Slime because uh, I don't have enough time to react to it. Uh, we'll see if I react to it later on or not. 
Oh, another thing, I did not react to Nanasu no Taizai trailer because I did not see season 3 after hearing the mount, the colossal disaster that had happened. I've seen season 1 and 2, but season 3 I did not see. If season 4 turns out to be okay, I'll probably like bear through season 3 and then like watch season 4. So that's the reason why I did not like <coughs> see season 4 trailer. Uh, because uh, a lot of spoilers, I don't want, to get to, want myself to get spoiled. And uh, obviously I did not see season 3, so I won't be able to understand a few things if I see the trailer. So that's why I did not react to the trailer. Alright, so yeah, as I said, uh, these 5 animes I'll be doing uh, January 2021 and um <clears throat> yeah and okay uh, now to talk about a few other things now january 2021 a lot of animes like attack on titan is the top one obviously that is airing already uh promise neverland season two uh that's something else as i uh, like um that's really something else like uh, uh promise neverland was season one was uh, extremely interesting and a lot of mysteries and a lot of things so obviously this will be something big as well uh, Dr. Stone Stone Wars uh, this is season 2 and Dr. Stone was big as well and I really enjoyed myself uh, like watching Dr. Stone all of the like science stuff and everything uh, mixed with like daily life stuff and prehistoric kind of things so yeah that was another like big one um, uh, number four is uh, slime now slime um, I really cannot remember what actually happened it was quite a long while ago I saw seen slime I can't remember like the outline of each and everything the like uh, barely a few parts so I'll have to watch season one again rewatch it and then season two I'll just, like uh, watch it after it ends and um re-zero i reacted to it and obviously i cannot wait to react to the part to part two of season two so yeah and another one is uh, uh this is quite popular and uh, that is gotobun no hanayome like uh the, qu uh the english name is i think quintessential quintuplets yeah uh the se season two now i've seen season one and um <sighs> I'll probably watch like season 2 as well but obviously like this is like more of like a harem kind of uh, thing where like uh, and uh, I think the manga ended as far as I can remember and like I have this thing like I usually do this uh, in a few like these type of especially these type of animes uh, or mangas uh, like where there are more than one lo like love interest uh, like I have obviously have a favorite girl and I when the manga ends i kind of like skim not skim through it but i kind of search that who won in the end i won't spoil for you guys but the person who won uh, a lot of fans were not okay with that and i'm also not okay with that now i'm not sure about uh, like the developments that happened and i cannot say anything about that but uh, like it kind of like it took me like it took my interest a lot down uh, to watch this anime but i'll probably check check, check this out as well because obviously uh, if an anime exists i'll devour it that's my job <laughs> okay uh, another one uh, the next one is beastars se season two all right beastars is a really unique anime i loved season one uh, like that was a really unique experience and i really want to like react to this i'll react to this uh, and in this channel and so yeah i can't wait I really can't wait for this to start. Like I was waiting for Beastars to, for season two to start. Another anime that is that I'm waiting for is Vinland Saga. I'm really waiting for Vinland Saga season two to start. I don't know when it will, but uh, like Beastars was one anime that I was like impatiently waiting for. It's coming out, and Vinland Saga. When Vinland Saga comes out, I'll probably react uh, in this channel as well. Okay. Um, <clears throat> next is Log Horizon. Now this is a surprise. Log Horizon, I've seen, uh, I think it had season 1 and 2, I can't remember. I've seen season 1 and 2 and I cannot remember at all anything. I only remember the main girl's name. Uh, her name was Akatsuki, I think. And I can't remember anything. Like, she was a little ninja kind of girl. And I cannot remember anything about that. But Log Horizon is pretty, pretty uh, like, damn good. Like, uh, people usually compare it to SAO, but Log Horizon has a more kind of, like, 
uh, more gamerisk type of like environment where like it like the game mechanics you see it a lot more than SAO and I really like that like there's like a guild system and a lot of things like player housing and all uh, I, I remember one time uh, the main character kind of tricked the others using the player housing system somehow I cannot remember and the main character is pretty damn smart so yeah I'm uh, I'll probably rewatch the first two seasons then after this ends I'll binge it later on uh, Log Horizon is another one. Okay, uh, Cells at Work or Hataraku Saibo. Uh, I think uh, season two, this is, yeah. Uh, season one was pretty damn good and it like, uh, <laughs> like it educated us about a lot of things. And season two would probably be like, like continue from that. Uh, pretty excited for this as well. Okay, <clears throat> another one. Uh, Narasuna Taizai, obviously, Seven Deadly Sins. <clears throat> I'm not sure about uh, like who. Studio Dean is doing this. Did Studio Dean do it the previous season? Let me just check. I can't remember the uh, season 3 which studio did it. Um, let me just check quickly. Oh, Studio Dean did it. But, but uh, as far as I can remember, Studio Dean did not have any time to do it. So the animation was so atrocious. And the rating was like 6.3. Wow. <clears throat> and I also did not watch it because of that. Uh, but if this season uh, like does okay, <clears throat> I'll probably check uh, like bear through season three, or like read the manga at that portion. Uh, if I am really I'm not able to like look at it if it is that bad, uh, and then I'll uh, like watch season four. So yeah, Horimiya obviously as I said, um, Horimiya is uh, anime or uh, manga. It was a manga uh, where. Uh, which is pretty good like as like I usually do not like shoujo mangas but this was an exception I really liked it Mushoku Tensei as I said uh, this is also like one of those good isekais and I'm quite excited to I'm, I'm going to react to this as well and it has Gin, like the main character has Gintoki's voice actor and I'm a really big fan of him like Gintoki and his voice actor and everything so yeah that's another like uh, exciting thing for me to like I'm going to react to it obviously so yeah, that's another good thing. All right, now here's another one. Hataraku Saibo Black. Now, this one, I have read the manga, the first chapter of the manga, and it was pretty brutal. Like Hataraku Saibo, the, uh, the other anime, if you guys don't know, is like uh, like the, the body workings of a healthy human being. But this one, I think this guy is probably like a like big smoker. His lungs are almost like, gone almost like completely damaged and <clears throat> he is like an alcoholic has some kind of stds I, I i can't remember and all of these things like his body is a mess and the amount of chaos that is happening inside the body like this show shows us that now i think this will be pretty eye-opening for a lot of people and i'm really looking forward to this like uh, this is like if hataraku saibo is like a cute see like uh, cute girls doing cute things kind of anime uh, it's obviously not that but i'm saying i'm taking an example this is like a total uh, like mystery suspense thriller um like adventure like uh, kind of story dark story and uh, like <laughs> like both are like uh, completely opposite things so this will be a, a, like quite uh, interesting to see as well and yeah Oh, okay. The next one, Yuru Camp season two. Now I've seen Yuru Camp season one. It was like a uh, like slice of life, quite uh, like happy type of anime, uh, calm slice of life type of anime. And I'll probably check check season two out as well. Okay, the next one, Kumo Desu Nanika. Now I have no idea about this, but this was uh, in the list of my anime list for quite a long while. So I'll I'll definitely check this out because obviously it's an anime. So yeah. Um, there are a few others as well. I'm not sure about these. Uh, Kaifuku Jusushi no Yari Naoshi. I'm not sure what this is. Uh, Jakuchara Tomozaki kun. Ore dake Hayeru Kakushi Dungeon. World Trigger. Okay, World Trigger I've heard, but I've not seen season one. So, uh, if I have time, I'll probably check season one, then like season two, I'll continue. Ah, uh, non non beauty. Like I really want to see non non beauty, but I did not have the time. It like non non beauty is quite a like it's a size of life, obviously. Uh, like quite a like like long time it's been continuing. I'll probably check it out as well uh, if I have time later on. 
কেমনও জিহেন আই এম নট শিওর অ্যাবাউট দিস এস কে ইনফিনিট নট শিওর তাতে এবার লাজ ডঞ্জন মায়েনো মুরানো সোনেন গা জবানো মাছি দে কুরাসু ইউনা মনোগাতারি ওকে আই ডোন্ট নো হোয়াট টু ওকে বুঙ্গো স্টে ডগস ওয়ান আই হ্যাভ নট সিন বুঙ্গো স্টে ইজ ডগ সিজন ওয়ান অর টু সো আই এম নট শিওর অ্যাবাউট দিস বাট দিস উইল প্রবলি বি পপুলার এজ ওয়েল এক্স আর্ম আই এম নট শিওর উড়াসাকি পিকনিক সেইন কোকো দানশি ভলিবু ভ্লাড লাভ ওকে দিস নেক্সট নেক্সট ওয়ান্স আর আই ডোন্ট থিঙ্ক দিস আর কোয়াইট পপুলার ওন বি পপুলার দ্যাট মি জাস্ট চেক ওকে দ্যাট ওয়াজ ইট আই থিঙ্ক ইয়া ওকে দ্যাট ওয়াজ ইট অ্যান্ড there's there in in movie coming out evangelion i have not seen evangelion the anime so i can't say anything about this movie uh, princess principal i've heard this uh, about this a lot as well i'm not sure i've not seen the show gintama the final uh, boy gintama it's ending <laughs> seito kai yakuindomo movie uh, i've seen the anime the first season i think first two seasons i think the show just sense sailor moon sailor moon sailor moon's having a movie Okay, Girls and Pansar, uh, I did not see the anime, so obviously I don't know. Uchiu Senkan Yamato, um, okay. Alright. And Natsumi Yujin Cho is also coming back, I can see two episodes. Uh, Alice in Deadly School, I'm not sure about this, but uh, I'll check this out as well, because Alice in Deadly School is another anime that has been like in my anime list a uh, like later portion for a long time and i'm quite interested about this as well i think this is zombies yeah zombies uh okay azur lane okay um i'm a big gacha player i play fgo and honkai impact but i played azur lane for a few days but i did not continue so <laughs> okay that was it that was the full list okay guys 2021 is starting off pretty damn good and okay uh, i forgot to uh, like uh, react to this as well um, i'm i'm reacting to another trailer uh, if you guys are still here um just a sec now guys this anime is coming out in 2021 but not in january but like i'm pretty excited about this i've read the manga and this is record of ragnarok and this is a goddamn like amazing manga so when i heard that it's happening an anime like an anime is coming out i was so excited if you guys have not checked out the manga um i don't know if you should hold yourself a bit a little bit because the anime is coming out but if you're impatient this is more like a tournament uh, between gods and uh, humans just check let's check this out oh boy this was something the manga <clears throat> When this comes out, I'll also react to this. <laughs> oh boy. Seeing these fights coming into like life. Oh boy. Ah, there's Shiva. Brunhild <laughs> Okay these are spoilers if you get... okay I'll not say anything <laughs> Oh boy this will be something else One versus one yep Oh Oh my god the fights will be something else i can feel it damn oh <clears throat> oh <laughs> oh 
Oh, they're showing the names. Okay. That was Lu Bu or Ryofu, as they say. Oh my god, the voice acting. <laughs> oh, oh my god, I, I can't wait for this. Oh, so many things are coming out. Okay. Um. Oh boy, this was an experience. And the manga was an experience and I'm sure the anime will deliver because animation is looking pretty damn good and voice acting is top notch as well especially uh, the last one mm, it's party time <laughs> yep it is party time so 2021 is starting off quite well uh, especially in the anime department and <clears throat> i don't know what to say uh, a lot of new an more animes are going to come but uh, january 2021 has a huge vast like vast list of animes uh, and so yeah like Ah, like I cannot wait for everything to like come out. Oh boy, it's starting off pretty good, so I'm pretty happy. So, anyways, guys, this is like continuing for quite a long time. I will probably stop the video now. And um, so yeah, uh, so as I said, uh, the links are in the description below. Uh, obviously, I cannot uh, show the like uh, sound and like um the proper uh like video as well because of copyright problems i'm sorry for that but i'll be linking down the original videos below go check that out or you can like play it alongside mine uh, when i'm like reacting to the trailers so yeah guys so yeah guys thank you guys for watching um i'm really excited for 2021 the animes especially it was quite an experience and uh, reacting to the trailers and like uh, talking about the animes as well so i'll end this video now so thank you guys for watching if you're still here and i'll see you guys in the next video so be sure to like like comment and subscribe and uh i like i'll check them out i'll check the comments out as well and uh yeah so yeah guys uh, i'll be back with a new video next uh next time uh, so until then goodbye and have a nice day